Hey guys, this is Max Tapper again for Howcast, and I'm gonna show you how to do an incline dumbbell fly. Now, obviously the flies are gonna be the same. Basically it's a way of working your chest without having to use your triceps. So pulling your arms from the side into the midline. The only difference is now we're gonna be on the incline bench, basically moving up. Now what this is gonna do as opposed to the uh, normal fly is get a little more of your upper chest and a little bit more of your shoulders. So if that's a part of the body you're trying to develop, then this would be a good exercise for you. Let me show you how this works. Now this is our starting position. We're gonna pick up our dumbbells, we're gonna lay back and extend our arms straight up to the ceiling. Now, again we're gonna keep our shoulder blades pinched back, chest up, and we're gonna allow our arms slowly to come down to our midline, parallel to the floor. Back up, Stop right over our shoulders and back down, slow and controlled. There, back up. Once again. Good. Now, a tip for you guys. As I had said before, when you're doing a fly, you're not in a very stable position in your shoulder. So heavy weight for a fly is not recommended. It's better off to do a lot lighter weight and go through more reps and even focus on just controlling that muscle by itself. You're going to get the best results that way and end up being the safest. All right? So enjoy and have a good workout. It, it's definitely not a bulk builder, as we had said before, because if you're not able to use a lot of weight, then it's not going to be a bulk builder. It's going to be something that's going to help tone the muscle and uh, shape it in a little different way. So again, if you really want a bulk builder, you're going to go back to the bench press and the flat bench. But if you're looking for something that's going to shape your body, a fly is going to be an excellent choice. Thank you.